Greetings and salutations, and welcome back to our Let's Play of E4 with Red Bastard as Brittany. We last left our nation, we helped turn around a war that the papacy had waged in the Italian peninsula against Tuscany and also against Austria and Bavaria. Our troops haven't been performing very well. So we're going to try getting some more cannons, up our manpower. And we don't need this spy power, we don't need that spy power. We could invade further down here. Let's see, do you have any allies? You do Cusco, but you. You're also allied to Cusco. I've got a really good general. Can't let her go to waste. And let's see, we can make more states up here. And there. Mostly useful to us if it's got low autonomy. So let's try to bring down that autonomy. And the same applies here. This place is going to surrender very quickly. Okay, was there one other place we wanted to decrease the autonomy? Up there, I guess. Now we're going to save up for more manpower and for summit buildings. Now let's top off relations with some of our allies. And they're only as Cusco. We can't attack them. So now it's the perfect time to attack. Our subjects will get these other two provinces and start the sieges down here. We're getting some regimental camps, giving us more force limit. We ever switch to becoming an absolute monarchy? We did not. So let's save up some points and do that. Just go. S let's see. Should we go for the mountains? How good is their tech? 13. So it's pretty bad. Yeah, but we can't actually hit them there due to zone of control. Get low tech cost. We'll let it go more expensive. We don't want to pay more money for a fleet. We're going to save up for this tech rather than getting the idea. Okay, before we develop it all though, I want to build some more universities. So where needs development? Where do we need to develop? Here. So you get a university. I 
Yeah, these guys are completely occupied. So let's annex them, take all their cash. And if we are making pretty respectable money. So let's get some more universities in preparation for the next institution. And we'll continue developing and putting in manpower buildings and force limit buildings and all that. Fifty. Get a royal marriage here. It'd be great if we could get personal union over them. So hopefully Carlos will die young. Okay, I think we're almost done down here. Okay, do we make subject? No, we'll improve the opinion of our subject of us. They're hiding away. See, what would you give us to make the pain stop? Just those two provinces and all their money. Uh, let's wait till we get the, the next fort. Some improve relations up here. Improve relations down here. Let's check on trust. Okay, we'll capture this well before they Liberate Lima. We should just mark them as a co-belligerent. But we can pick on them again. It's not going to be a big deal. Unless somebody else like Portugal invades them. Hurry it up. Get 50 out of them points. And let's switch our government form to an absolute monarchy. That would have been helpful in that last war. Okay, let's start spreading out some more universities. Now to wait for this to fall. Because you're being intransigent. I 
really like that personal union over Spain. Okay, we capture this, so let's go ahead. And piece them out. We'll give them this guy. Move these back up here. Put these generals in charge over here. And we're already up to 20,000 manpower. Push with Denmark is over. We might want to attack them. So our only ally is Milan. We could easily beat up on them. We could take this stuff. So why don't we... Oh, we got a free merchant. Let's trade power to the North Sea. We do we need another merchant here. We need one in the North Sea. Okay, let's take them out. Take all their money. Okay, now our Peruvian threat Quan is much tougher than this, or at least much larger. Here we can support another 12 units, which is great news. Okay, so that's seven, and we can get five more here. We do need some more infantry. Okay, did we top off relations here? Kind of. Still working on that. Good there. Okay, we need to boycott them, embargo them. And who are other rivals? Denmark, so we could send them an insult. And an embargo. How long before we can invade England? Three more years. Let's make sure that we have claims. Only allied to Sakalava, that's the nation in Madagascar. That's pretty hilarious. Shanti's still free after all this time. I'd really like to invade West Africa, but I'm going to wait until we have the imperialism CB. Which is our next level of Diplotech. Okay, let's get some more manpower. Yeah, we can get 620 up there. So, we don't want this to happen. So, the best way to avoid that. to spend down we're building a manpower building up here right where was that okay we've only got 158 manpower so let's do this and then let's cancel all this infantry that we're ordering, because we need manpower.
Yes, exploits are good for all of us. Okay, who do we side with here? Side with the bourgeoisie. Because we can get money from them. If we needed to, we could give money to the clergy. We needed some spy power up here. And I think Scotland needs to be invaded at some point. We want their colonies. Eventually, we can upgrade these forts. I think that's going to take a number of years. Yeah. So those are top of the line for the moment. We can make another unit of troops. We've got 12. Let's get that. And let's not get rid of these cavalry. We don't... We need five units of cavalry. Instead, get another. Another cannon. I do want some more infantry. We definitely needed more cannons. Our troops were just underperforming. Okay, hire him? Yeah. Get some army tradition. Okay, we have a royal marriage there. Let's top off new one here. A consort, a bohemia. Oh, they proposed. I'm gonna put it on Facebook. I tell my friends. Let's see how long this video has been going on. Seventeen minutes. The pictures of me showing off the ring. And we can't get a royal marriage with the Pope because, well, you know. Pretty far ahead of time there, so let's just reduce down that inflation. Okay, so we have a university here. We could use points to get more development. I don't think we want to, because we're trying to get this uh, administrative efficiency, we're trying to get this advanced CB, and then we want our military points for our ideas. Now, speaking of that, let's get rid of this parish registries and take idea cost reduction. We could have waited. year or so until we got more points here. But now we're getting, getting over a thousand men per month. And now we'll send them to the colony where they're already going. Okay, we want to see beyond them. What could we claim? Could do anything. New world otherwise. So let's see. Let's do Kespec. Can we do Kespec? No. We do something Eora. Uh... 
And we can just claim this right there. Okay, so if we did declare war on Scotland, what would people's reactions be? Burgundy would protect them, so we don't want that. But if we attack Denmark, Portugal's defender of the Catholic faith, so yeah, we're going to have to call in Spain. Burgundy wouldn't join in? Okay, let's influence them. A little bit more trust. Okay, so one thing I'm worried about is great power intervention. So it'd be two of us against Portugal, and Denmark isn't on the list. So Ottomans could intervene. I bet they would. Well, you know what? They don't really have anyone else protecting them. So we're just going to call everyone in. Yeah. And let's get down here as quickly as possible. Their goal will be to knock Portugal out of the war pretty quickly. Then there'll be zero great powers on the enemy side. And no great powers can intervene. I really did want to get Burgundy in this war because the whole point of it was initially bring them into a war so that we could attack Scotland and take their colonies. Stack white. Let's get some spy power over here. So sadly, that was one of our generals that had four siege. Another great one. The one we've had for a while. I guess I think it was. Yeah, it was. How about here and move all the way? No, can't we? Never mind. Let's try. Nope, we need to get troops over there before that would be reasonable. Okay, um, how about down here? We'll split these troops, just send one down. Okay. 23 minutes, so another 5 minutes or so. It's getting late, so I'm going to stop this video soon. Not work on it anymore tonight. Well, that's a really good combat general. He's not helping us with the sieging. We've already cracked the walls, though. Ooh, Spain wants some of this. That'd be a way to ensure that you guys couldn't be friends. Okay. 
Okay, paid off that one. And so we got some spy power in Denmark and in Portugal to help out with sieges. About to capture both of these within probably the next six months. Okay, who are you? Norwegian. We are at war with Norway. So why don't we move down here, try to capture that stuff. Yeah, this fort's gonna fall pretty quickly too. So somebody's invading California. So get these guys repaired just a little bit. Portugal is a major naval power. We should be careful. Took over our other. Anne, sure. That'd be called Anne. Okay, Portugal still has high enthusiasm. That's crazy. We'll just move them down to Cadiz. Uh, we'll lose stability because we've got plenty of admin points. I don't think these are our ships that are dying yet. We lost a big ship. All those ships before were Spanish ships or whatever. Yeah, Spanish. We did lose three big ships in that battle. Let's get these guys just back in the port in Lisboa for a month. Only get five, so we'll send them into Tangiers. Now let's get three more big ships to replace the ones we lost. And we should put a university in London as well. Okay, so we're occupying some stuff from the Danish over there, but we're going to have them concede the entire region, so we're not going to stress about that. The Portugal's enthusiasm is down to medium. We'll wait till it's set low. Sadly, they're not co belligerents. We can't get that much out of them. I bet other people are going to start attacking them as they become increasingly isolated. People like Morocco.
Yeah, let's get out here and join in on the attack on our fleet. Okay. Well, Portugal, you brought this on yourself. We tried to be your friend all game. You can ask the viewers. They they heard. Okay, what does Milan want to do? Give us money. We'll make the peace deal. Thank you very much. Okay, is anyone trying to get their stuff? Well, Burgundy didn't want in on this. Otherwise, we would give them some of that. Okay, well, I guess I'll just peace you out. You're not allowed to be allied to Ottomans because, you know, screw those guys. And then we're going to take your war reparations. This is Switzerland Valley too. This is Savoy. But they like us. You're going to have to give Wallace back to them. Maybe even Zurich. Lodstada. That's what happens, Milan. Okay, who's next? Portugal, probably. Okay, Portugal, let's have that talk. First of all, let's take your Mexico. Then you have to give that, or this, that. You have to give something. Spain. We only have 55 war score against them yet. We'll have to get some more war score. Well, what if we just stripped them? Of Caribbean's too much. What about Peru? It's got a fort. Yeah, but Peru's not too much. How about we take Mexico from them? And some of their islands. I'll just take those. Yeah, that's good enough for the moment. No, Denmark. I don't think that's going to happen. Let's march these guys back up. And we'll prepare to do a landing in Norway. Just want their capital. Oh, we have a free merchant now. 
Let's uh, push some trade power from here. And we've got some cash, so let's fill in some of those places. We don't own Oxford yet. And your manpower building is there. You get 625 manpower, five. 625 is the best. But we do have 41k manpower, so we're doing all right in that regard. Okay, our fleet is in place. Let's switch around these generals. And drop you guys off there and just march over to the Norwegian capital. We can get a lot more ships. So let's just spend all of our money on that. We should get a lot more transports too. Okay, California is not an acceptable name. So, what can we name it after? Hmm. Yeah, I guess we're running out of things to name after, so this is California. Perfect acceptable name, as I said. We'll just name it California. And this video has been 36 minutes, so let's stop it there.